this agent you see here can work as a system for this company here okay because we have had all information what is your is your opening time and we okay we have the same here what is the price about tlice it, it is the same here this information is here okay now we'll go together step by step to create this workflow okay so let's go i start with chat gpt to find a website a company for this tutorial so let's go okay here i choose a niche and i choose also a country and ask chat gpt to find 10 websites where i can go to check if i can get information about a cart and after that after some minutes i get this website we'll work with it there are many information on this website okay we have the time opening time for work the prices and we have many other information we can create some document with them and send them out to our super base and start putting the automation for this company so let's go so here the first thing i have done here is create a google docs where i add all information about the prices the contact and opening time and go to the website find those information and add it to my google form okay for the prices we have a table here so i have used code to create the same table okay but it don't work so i have copy and paste the table information to my google sheet and i've get a pdf so we have some information now to create our database in superbase and star automations okay now we can go to anything and start automation with our workflow here we are in anything you can find the link in the description to get access in this website okay it is a free link okay so here you can start with a new workflow how to do that if you go if you get access to your anything dashboard you have the home here and you can create on create a new workflow okay we want to send our document this is the website the aircat website i have choose to create those two documents two pdf the prices and contact opening time we can find them here opening time the contact table i have created a pdf with it and location and many many other information okay here we want to send them in superbase a database where the ai agent must go to find information if customer need it so we will create here a push name our database our workflow push data okay push data a one agent one we can push data okay so we start with start with a trigger let me click manual trigger and add google, google drive like that to download file okay download file and we want to download a file so you want to add our document in google drive to find it with google drive let me find it. the prices and the location will add to our google drive so we can find them here okay once we add it we'll find them here so how to do that let me check prices contact okay let me go there prices add and contact add. so here you must create a new credential okay how to do that click on open doc and go down to find google cloud click on it and here you can click on console you choose your mail and you click on console okay here you have different project okay if i click on it you'll see i have already different project if you don't have any project click on new project and add the name okay create your project once it's created click on select project your project will be selected here go there and add write google drive and click on google drive api okay and enable it enable and manage it okay before continue go there click on api and go to off 
constant screen okay here get sorry add a name add any name you want and here you want to add your mail next external next again add your mail again next continue create once it's created you must go here audience you must add your gmail here okay save it now you can go to create a new credential api credential and here create a new credential here choose off choose web go down click here and go to your anything copy this link go there paste it and go down to create after that you have two code click on client id paste it here go now for client secret and paste it here save and click on google off go here choose choose your and continue select those are here continue and it's okay now you can close this and close this if you do one click you'll see all information about your google drive okay now google drive is connected and we have choose our file now you want to add a vector store superbase you hide superbase vector store and you choose add document to vector store you must create a new credential here okay we'll do it after so we can place them here okay continue we'll create our agent we can change this name agent okay now we'll add here a, a chat trigger okay place it here and now we want to add a ai agent also we must add an llm okay you do want to click here you choose your llm there are many here but i use chat okay and you must create a new credential okay you need api key okay how to do that you go to platform platform that openai.com okay and you connect your account you click on your profile you go to billing you you make make sure you add some money here from from five to ten dollar or more and after that you can go to api key okay create a new api here name your api click here click on default and click on create secret key after that we get a code you copy your code you go there you paste it here and you save and you okay you can use now here you can use tools that you want but i choose gpt 4.0 okay and now we want to add a memory we'll use this possible start memory and create a new credential for it okay so we have we need some information here how to get those information you go to superbase.com okay you create an account on your superbase okay let me you create a, an account and after that you will get access in this dashboard here you create a new organization okay and you name it create organization you name it you click on create organization okay okay here you can rename your project like that and here you create a password and you copy this password you go in your n10 and you paste it here it is your first information after that you can use any region here and click on create new project uh, loading and after that you can go to project setting and you have your project name and after that you click on connect okay here you use was sql and you go down here you do one click here and you have those information you copy the first place it in the first okay the second here you copy it users user you press it here in the user and you copy this number and you paste it here and i think it's done
is done. And after that, you click on save. And we we'll, mm, we have an error here. We must the os must be in the os have done an error, and this must be this name database copy database here copy this os paste it in os and and okay and save okay our password is connected okay so here you have connected this is working okay the next is to add superbase so you, you write superbase vector store okay you click on it and you must put a new credential here put a new credential and you need those information to get it you must go to your superbase okay and go to projects setting and click on data api okay here you have the first information click on it go to your anything paste it here return to superbase click on revolve and copy again paste it here and connect it okay this is the first connection close this and click on this document okay go down you click here and you get a code here okay this is a code you copy this code you go to your superbase and you go to sql editor you paste the code here and you click on run and you'll run this code and get a new database new, new document if you go to table editor you'll notice that you have new document here okay fine we have our document here if you go to your anything you can now you have create a credential you can now create a name let me add a vector store okay use this tool to find information about aircraft company okay when people customer ask something you must go there to find information okay this document is the same here document here okay we choose it and it's done after that you must add an LLM choose this GPT you have already created your credential choose text embedding free small and it's done so we can use it now okay actually it's like a, a simple GPT which can help you if you check in your agent system message you have you are an helpful assistant it can work as an assistant so if I send hi you will reply me okay like a simple LLM okay if I send it will give get give me the information okay the answer so we want to give it information about this website okay those information we have create and put in Google Drive we want to give with information and we will be able to answer and give information about this website okay how to do that do a click here and the same credential you have here superbase icon six you create here okay you can use the same here okay it's work after that here you add an LLM the same you choose the same and also you add this and you use binary because when you download the file in the file in your google drive the file the price pdf you get a binary, a binary okay so you use the same here and also you add this option okay it's done so now we can send our information here if you go to your superbase table editor you'll see you have your document and you haven't any information on it so if i go there and text workflow i will download the file here and send it to my that superbase so i must click here text workflow and wait download and save it here
okay once it's okay i can go to check reload it and you'll see okay now we have information here we have the price and and so on okay now this this information uh, superbase we can find it here so because here we have used the same document where we have saved our information so now we, we must write something here and uh, maybe it will be very okay if we use ChatGPT to create our <laughs> our ChatGPT to create our system message okay let me okay create the system message for this agent it must reply to customers about this company and add, add the link okay i use this gpt paste it and don't save we must check now okay so click here let me reset okay and we'll what is your opening this is your opening time you must go to check information on our separate base and give us okay it's done is give an information like that ah, okay 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 i have i understand because i have add only the the price so we must add the second file that name is cut contact okay we must add the second file we forget that okay so one click again and send it to superbase okay let's check okay we have prices and we have also add the contact about uh, all so we, we we go to check again okay let me copy this and paste now we have sent the second file and we it must give us so this is the opening we have first days and send sunday okay we have the same here okay let me check this price okay what is the price about stylis stylis for for okay let me check still stylized okay for this normally you must send out 16 pound okay so let's check okay stylized the price for white card is stylized 60 pound seven senior seven six seventy six pound and the master we have 80 it, it is the same here this information is here so now this agent you see here can work as assistant for this company here okay because we have had all information so after that if you want you can change this chat to add whatsapp or telegram if you want and it's finished We'll create another video to explain how you create agent for over company. So don't forget to subscribe and like and share. See you next.